A battery pack is one of the most costly components of an electric scooter. Electric scooter batteries are constructed from several little powerhouses called battery cells. These cells are tightly packed together to create a bigger battery. There are three different types of batteries used to power e-scooters. Lithium-ion battery, lead-acid battery and lithium-manganese battery. By far the most popular battery type is lithium-ion battery. They are more effective than lead-acid batteries because they are lighter and more energy dense. Also, lithium-ion batteries don't require much maintenance. Although they are a bit more expensive, their longevity makes up for the difference. Before the widespread use of lithium-ion batteries, lead-acid batteries were mainly used. Their most significant advantage was their relatively low price. However, compared to lithium-ion batteries, lead-acid batteries are heavier and less effective. Also, they have a shorter lifetime and are less resilient. Lithium-manganese batteries are a more recent type and they are consistently improving. They're getting smaller and more efficient. However, these battery packs are expensive. So for now, lithium-ion batteries are the most effective, long-lasting and robust batteries, making them the best choice for electric scooters. How to compare different batteries? Here are some of the most crucial metrics to remember. Volt is a significant consideration since it impacts the electric scooter's speed and power. A good general rule of thumb is that the battery output should be higher than the motor input voltage for optimum performance. Most scooters are available in volts of 36, 48 and 52. Amp power rating indicates the battery's capacity to store energy. Longer lasting, more powerful batteries have greater amp power ratings. Most scooter batteries range in capacity from 8 amp hours to 50 amp hours. Watt hour indicates the battery's capacity to store a certain amount of energy. Basically, you get watt hours if you multiply battery voltage by the number of amps. If the electric scooter battery is 36 volts and 10 amp hours, it has an energy capacity of 360 watt hours. Advanced e-scooters can have capabilities even over 2000 watt hours, whereas a regular budget scooter will have a capacity of about 250 watt hours. How to choose an electric scooter battery? Now you know what type of batteries are there and what are their most important metrics. With that knowledge, we should be able to make a difference between different electric scooter batteries. As mentioned before, lithium-ion battery is the best choice in terms of battery chemistry. In terms of the range, look for the battery that has the most amps. In terms of performance, look for the battery that has the most volts. In an ideal world, you want a scooter that has high voltage battery with a high amount of amps. Let's assume you are choosing between two electric scooters. One has a 36 volt and 10 amp power battery. Another has a 48 volt 7.5 amp hour battery. Both batteries have 360 watt hours of energy capacity. Well, if everything else like motor power and the weight of the scooters is the same, then the first one would have a better range but it could deliver less power to the motor, which could result in worse performance. The second one would have less range, but thanks to the higher voltage, it could deliver more power to the motor. Therefore, it would have a better performance. How far can an electric scooter go in a single charge? The range of electric scooter depends on several variables, including battery type, rider's weight, speed, type of terrain and how frequently you start and stop. Cheap electric scooters usually have a range of about 10 to 15 miles. However, long range electric scooters can have a range of about 50 miles. When choosing an electric scooter, there is another battery criterion to think about. You can choose a scooter with a removable battery or a built-in battery. Built-in batteries are integrated into the frame of the electric scooter and you cannot remove or swap them out. 
You can charge a built-in battery with a charging cable that is connected to the scooter. Removable batteries are designed to be easily detached from the scooter and replaced with a fresh battery. This means that you can carry an extra battery with you and swap it out when the original battery runs out of power. Swappable batteries are also convenient for charging, as you can charge a battery separately from the scooter. However, swappable batteries are usually heavier. And lastly, how long do electric scooter batteries usually last? It mostly depends on different variables like the type of battery, how often it is used and how well it is maintained. With proper care and maintenance, electric scooter batteries typically last 2-4 to four years. You can prolong the lifespan of electric scooter battery if you take good care of it. Here are some tips for it. Avoid using your battery on red. Make sure the power is never lower than 10%. Avoid overcharging. Store the battery in a cool and dry place. Do not expose the battery to extreme temperatures. That's it for today. I hope this video helped you to understand electric scooter batteries better. If so, please hit the like button and consider subscribing so you won't miss out on other useful videos. Thanks for watching and I wish you a safe ride. Until next time.